Okay, hello, welcome back to Hoarder's Heart. And we're continuing chopping away at this uh, playroom. Well, trying to make it into a playroom. And we're just gonna keep going and going and keep this wonderful momentum going. And we're gonna start right over here in this little corner. And we're gonna start to sort. Let's see, what do we have over here? Well, we have a box. That's easy, a box. It's empty. Now, I could totally toss this, right? Right, it's trash. There's no need to keep a, a Under Armour box. But just for sorting reasons for now, just so I can start keeping like with like and um, looking at everything that we have as a whole, I'm probably gonna use this for an actual uh, organizer of something. I'm sure there's some random toy that I can go ahead and put this into. So we'll go over there and let's see, where should we start on the boxes or should we start on, oh, there are some boxes over here. And let's actually start with this box today. So we have doodle pads because my kids love drawing. We love to draw. Look at that, it's brand new. Brand new. And let's see. Oh yeah, it's brand new. What I think I really do need to start I do need to start like an art box because we are huge on arts and crafts. We have so many of them and um, I gotta start doing that. Hey, it's Christmas, but it's February, but it's a brand new craft. You know I'm not gonna toss this, but I do have downstairs a bin that has Christmas crafts that's already organized, some left over from previous years. So yeah, see, I can't toss this, it's brand new. But at least it has a home. That's what we're trying to do is a home, right? And a piece of paper that can be tossed. That probably was like I was packing something and it, I just, I have no idea. Oh, biscuit, the book. Let's put it in its book home. Get all the books with the books. And um, random piece of, okay. Let's put that over there. I have a feeling this was one of my hurry boxes and basically what my hurry boxes are is I had a project. I was doing a project, a uh, random piece of paper, we'll just toss that in a bag. Uh, oh, glue sticks, hey, glue sticks. I could put that in my glue stick bin and that's trash. Uh, basically what a, uh, my hurry boxes are is if I have a big mess or a big project and guess what? I need to hurry up and put it in a box and get it out because someone's coming over and I don't want to see my mess. Hey, burlap. Uh, I love to make burlap uh, wreaths. So I made Christmas ones and I've made Valentine's ones. So I can put that in my crafting stuff because I do have bins for all that. And little, uh, little lammy uh, for Easter. Hey, Easter's coming up. That's uh, April 1st. So that's actually a few weeks away. So I could probably re-gift this. This is really cute. I don't even know why I got it. Oh, I do. Actually, you know what? This was this is, was bought originally to make an actual gift and put the name on it because I have one of those Cricut machines. So that was originally bought for that. And let me see, a book. This is my older ones. He has a bookshelf too. We could go do that. And, uh, okay, a mat. Oh, a dust mask. Yeah, dust mask. Okay. That can be tossed right now. Hey, it's the Moby Go. We found that game. So I can go put it in that box that has all the miscellaneous things. Just needs a little cleaning. We're gonna give this away. They will not play this, They're, they just don't. And Christmas crafts, this was, yes, for Christmas. Oh, this was part of making the wreaths. I made the wreaths with these ones. So, all right, well, we know what that is. And hey, we got an empty box, Woohoo! All right, just moving along here. All right, so let's see, color pencils. I definitely have a bin for that. This is definitely, oh man, this is definitely a bag of Mod Podge stuff that needs to be sorted through. And there's a lot of toys, a picture, Paw Patrol. There's one of the cars. Um, they need some good cleaning. What else is in here? Oh, bath time markers, brand new, might I add trash um this is a big box that definitely needs some sorting and i don't know if i should go through this now or if maybe maybe i'll just do this as its own video just going through this little box and sorting it right now i kind of want to make more space i'm kind of in a space kind of mood 
Oh, a little cowboy hat. My boys have worn this on many different occasions. Um, for whatever odd reason, it was cowboy day, um, a western day or whatever at school, or just random things where they needed a quick little uh, hat. You can see it's been used and been loved. Probably won't toss that because I do, um, they do need it for when they have theme days in school. Here's a box. Uh, I'll toss this one. There really is no reason. I mean, I mean, I was, I did save the Under Armour so that I could go ahead and um, use it to organize things. But maybe we'll just, just to make some headway, we'll just toss this one. And then this is, ah, here we go. This is an old T-ball hat. So this is an old T-ball hat. And see, these are the things that I have a hard time throwing away. They're very sentimental. He loves T-ball. These are his hats. My little brain will think of all these wonderful crafty things that I can make as a theme for a T-ball hat. So this definitely has to go it's kind of an undecided because I'm not quite sure what to do. A little minion. My youngest loved minions. They were his favorite. He doesn't really play with minions anymore, to be honest. He's kind of uh, outgrown them the past couple of years. Um, and I think we're going to do that in the give. We're we'll definitely put a give. And oh, this is actually, oh, it's stuck. What is it? This is oh, a little for real friend, um, Pug. Oh, man, <laughs> here's going to be another struggle because my oldest loves pugs. He's loved them since the past three years. He just loves pugs. He wants a pug. But we got a ton, and I mean a ton, of stuffed animal pugs. And I don't know. I kind of feel like what I will do is, like I said, I'm doing the like with like. So I'll put all the stuffed animals together, and I will have to go and have them make decisions on what to keep and what to toss. I know he, or donate, I should say donate because I really don't want to trash things. Um, yeah, I think we'll just make, we'll put that all together. And then oh, got some books. Books are easy. I like books. Books have homes right away. The Shrinky Digs. <laughs> oh my God, I found the instructions. See, here is my crazy mind. If you remember a few videos back, I had tossed this. I was like, I'm tossing it. But then the inner hoarder in me was like, no, 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 let's keep it. You'll find the instructions. <gasps> I found the instructions. So now it's winter. It's a great project for us to do. And then we'll have a night of fun. And then we could toss the box and the crap, but yay. I can't believe I found it. <laughs> This is, oh, this is to the uh, 3D Quixel, so I do know where that goes for my son. It goes uh, in his room where I put that away. Oh, biscuit. Some more biscuit books. We'll put him away. This looks like it goes to uh, Blaze. This is a bla This is a piece to the Blaze, so that is another box that I'm going to have to start. I'm going to have to start a box where we can um, put Blaze stuff in. So um, we'll do that, and oh, we're getting a space. Love it, and this is a, a piece to Angry Birds. I'll donate this, they haven't done. See, I can't throw this out. I have to donate it in some kind of Ziploc bag with miscellaneous toys and give it away. <laughs> That's something that a hoarder I know has a hard time. We just, or at least maybe I should just say me as a hoarder. I do definitely struggle with uh, throwing things away. I feel like if this still has a purpose or a function. And oh, this was a teddy bear that was given when they were babies. Um, there is some sentimental values. I think I got all my baby shower and stuff like that, but I'm gonna be strong. I'm gonna be strong, I'm gonna be strong. I'm gonna donate it to somebody else and a clothes tag. Yay, easy. Uh, I love the easy ones. Oh, Paw Patrol soccer ball, but it needs to be inflated. I, we do have, my uh, youngest loves soccer and he used to love Paw Patrol. Um, I think we'll donate. I'll have my husband um, inflate this back up for them again, but then we'll, um, you know, maybe we'll sell it or, or donate it and put it in that pile. So, all right, we made a nice little space right here. So thank you so much for watching and catch you next time. Bye.